What's going on YouTube? It's Mark the Greatest and today I'm going to tell you guys how to cope with loneliness. So as you guys may have heard or if you haven't already heard me say this, a lot of the time at school, because I'm in high school, I'm in 11th grade, a lot of time at school I have to learn or I have to I deal with loneliness every single day. And I've told you guys, it's kind of the reason why I'm depressed all the time. So I'm going to give you guys some ways to cope with it. One way is to, you know, pray to God. That's one thing because from ex from my experience, praying to God is has helped me a lot. Like, I would pray to him about anything and, you know, like the next day after I would be really depressed, the day just got better. And I just feel like that prayer played a role in that, you know, and me getting better. Another way is like, if you don't believe in the Bible, you can always listen to some music you like. Like for me, I listen to a beat that I like. Um, you know, you if you guys, if any of you guys know Kid Ocean, his beats are amazing. And I like to listen to things that does, it doesn't always have to have lyrics. And sometimes I want to get away from like curse words and stuff because I just feel like all of that stuff, all of, all of those words and foul things well, I consider it to be foul because of my Christian faith. But I consider all of those foul things to be like dirt in my brain. So I just need something to just clear clear my mind. Like if I find a good beat by Kid Ocean, shout out to Kid Ocean. I love him. His beats are amazing. I show good love to him like a lot of the time because of his beats. But... um. Y'all, excuse me, but I have some noise upstairs. I think it's parents and my sister. But anyway, you know, kid, yeah. Listen to some music that will get your mind off. Like, another type of music I would listen to is, like, meditation from underwater music. Because, like, just the sound, just the sound of water. Just you could hear the water just splashing and it just to me it just cleared my mind. So that's another way. And that's where that's another thing too, meditation in general. Like it doesn't have to be with music. Just sit down, cross your legs, close your eyes, put your hands on your knees. You guys know how meditation works, but meditation is another way to cope to cope with loneliness. Because it gets, like I said, with the music, it gets that loneliness, that depression out of your mind, you know? Another way is if you actually want to stop it, I suggest joining a club or, you know, joining an activity where there's a lot of people, a lot of new people you've never met and you can make friends. And that's how I met one of my friends, like, even though I hated tennis, like, legitimately, like, at first I liked it, it was pretty fun, but after a while, it was like, I just, something about the, something about the sport that I just did not like, like, the tennis just got away from, from my interest, but I had met a friend on the tennis team, you know, and he's still a good friend to me this day, to this day, you know. And, you know, to me, loneliness, I feel like you people want to make it like I don't know how to explain it. It's like you you make things the way you make it like or you take things the way you make it. You know what I mean? Like, good example. So, people would say, oh, like, to, about me a lot of times. Oh, that boy is so quiet. Why is he so quiet? 
oh, he's so weird just for not, like, talking or whatever. And I feel like just because you're by yourself, it doesn't mean that you're weird. I feel like from that, you know, like, a scenario like that, people make it what they want to make it. You know what I'm saying? They label things the way they want to label things. And I just feel like people... And, uh, and another way to cope with loneliness is to accept reality, you know, and if you are alone, if, I mean, I'm not saying that, ugh, ugh, let me, let me, uh, I always drag on my words or just stop. But if you, let me see, if you, um, what was I going to say? If you're by yourself, right, where there's no one around. Is like, and then you say, oh, I'm so lonely. Oh, I don't have any friends around. Well, you just put that in your mind. You just program that in your mind that you are lonely. If you just get out of that mindset, you know, you know what I'm saying? And to, and accept life for what it is. Like people say a lot of things, label a lot of things, but at the end of the day, it is what it is. It's like your opinion matters, but at the same time, it doesn't because you just, in life, you just have to accept things for the way it is. And that's why it's kind of like like these. That's why I grow this because I grew my locks is because I accepted for what my hair does, you know. I accepted for how God created me, and that's why I'm growing it because I accept it. I accept, you know, that I have raw light skin, you know, goatee growing, uh, you know, you know what I mean? A beard growing. I just accept things. And that's another way to cope with loneliness is to accept for who you are. And another piece of advice, don't let people, you know, put you down. You know what I'm saying? Like, and another way to cope with um, loneliness is find something that you're really passionate about. So for me, it was YouTube. I love making YouTube videos. I love, um, you know, the idea of just speaking and giving advice to people on YouTube, on camera, you know, where I can just put all of my, all of my experiences, all of my thoughts and my advice just out to the world and that's another way like if you're you know let let me give you an, another example like rappers right they're not rappers they had rappers nowadays they have a passion for rap I wouldn't say all of them but majority of them do like I'll give you an old school one like Tupac for example he was in the studio all day making music. Like, he literally make one song, like, within an... He would make, like, three songs within an hour. And he was that dedicated. And to him, music was life. Music was his everything. And that's what YouTube is to me. YouTube is my everything. Though I my work ethic isn't that hard. Like, I wouldn't make, like, three videos in a day. But... At least I'm on my grind. You know what I'm saying? Like, find something that that will help you be on your grind, man. Because, literally, you can get so distracted by the world. So distracted of what they think of you. When it, at the end of the, at the, end of the day, it really does not matter. <clears throat> Excuse my voice. But at the end, of, at the end of the day... All that matters is you, what you think about you. And with you, a lot of things can happen. And with you, you are enough. You know what I'm saying? Like, you can make a lot of things happen that no one can imagine you doing. Like, good example, like, I keep, I keep mentioning this idea, but like, growing my dreadlocks, my brother... Never thought that I'd grown, but I did because I just found 
that it was my passion, that it was meant a lot to me, you know? And yeah, so that's it for the advice of how to cope with loneliness. Please like, comment, and subscribe to me. And if you guys have any questions, please comment down below. Follow my Instagram, follow my Snapchat, and peace out, y'all. Let me do my uh let me do my official dab. Dab, okay. One more time. Dab, okay. One more time. Dab. Okay. See y'all. Peace out. God bless. See y'all. Mark the Greatest is out.